SOS News takes a look at coal mining outside Singleton in New South Wales. This is a distant view from the side of the main highway of what's actually going on as far as excavating farmland of the area. Kilometres out of Singleton, our camera pans from the rural area across and into the open cut where the coal's excavated from. As you can see, it's a massive operation. This once was grazing stock and it's part of our food bowl. Now look at it. Large excavation machinery that's dwarfed by the size of the cut area. As we said, rural land. Now, the coal empire, all for the big dollars. Once farmland, now a wasteland. As you can see, farming property here, adjacent. The coal is moved from the excavation area to a dumping area and then loaded onto train carriages, as you can see here from the machine behind which fills up these carriages to the top. And these trains were noted by us around about 12 minutes apart on one section of line just outside Singleton as we drove along the New Ingle Highway. On the left you see here a coal train. On the line with 74 carriages and you'll note as we get towards the end here or the front rather you will see three large locomotives hauling this load of coal. It's all being carried on a single line that goes to Moree. That's right, a single line with loop lines along it and it carries the passenger rail as well. Imagine these weighted trains 70 carriages of coal going along these, this single line track which you see and the wheels are starting to wear the edges of it now. How long is this going to last this sort of pressure and how many trains a day travel it? That's it, the one line, no more. This is just the beginning, there's more to come on this. SOS News is here to keep you informed of what the government and corporations are doing behind the back doors of your Australia.